To make the Pop-Tart dough, I mix tan clay with translucent clay, and then I cut out each Pop-Tart with a rectangle cookie cutter. And now I'm just smoothing the edges with a toothpick, and I'm gonna make little holes with the same toothpick. Get it done tonight. You're looking so tasty. Your smile is driving me crazy. You got that rugged look. Now I'm gonna add an eye pen. I need you to be mine. Come on, baby. And I'm gonna add yellow and orange chalk to make the Pop Tart look like it's been toasted. And to make the frosting, I'm going to use TLS, which is liquid clay. And then I'm going to mix a lot of white chalk with the TLS. And you want a lot so that it shows up white and not clear. And you can even add a tiny, tiny bit of white acrylic paint just to make sure it shows up white when it's baked. And now I'm going to add it to the Pop-Tart. Your move, cause if you don't, don't think I won't. I bet you're silky smooth. What you gonna do now? The world alone move towards me now. And once I've spread out the frosting, I'm gonna add rainbow color sprinkles to make it look like a confetti cupcake pop tart. Amazing. To make a wild berry pop tart, I'm gonna mix white and a deep purple color to make the frosting, and I'm just using acrylic paint. I'm just going to start painting on to the Pop-Tart and you just want to fill out all of the edges and make sure it's pretty smooth, as smooth as you can make it. And while the paint's still wet, I'm going to use turquoise colored clay to make the little lines that the icing would make. Now I'm going to mix red and white paint together for the frosting on the strawberry milkshake pop tart. Don't be afraid, it's okay if you bake acrylic paint, but you just want to make sure it's fully dry before you bake it. Now I'm going to add the pink paint or frosting to the pop tart. Be my king boy, we could be a thing boy. Just think if And now I'm going to just add the sprinkles. To make the strawberry pop tart, I'm just going to pick apart pieces of yellow, orange, red, pink, and green clay. And I'm just going to add it to the pop tart. And when you're finished with each one, don't forget to bake them until they're hard, maybe about 20 to 30 minutes. And then you're finished.